it's your boy Saucy and your girl Honey, and we back with another, another big song this video. You know what I'm saying, Let me put this down. Yeah, yeah. Before you start singing and rapping. Uh, Hold on. Hold on, right? Mm. Yo, honey on the mic and we about to get busy We about to hop into this video But before we do, you already show Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe Turn on them post notification bells And join the empire Ooh, don't forget to follow us on Instagram Run it up here on the road to 10K I'm on the road to 100K And you gonna get us there, okay? What do you want to tell Joe Biden right now? Baby, follow me. <laughs> Bing bong. You see these dogs? Bing bong. <laughs> what we are here today with is baking cookies with Saucy and Honey for the very first time. It's the very first time for all of us, okay? Saucy and Honey have never cooked baked cookies baked cook together cookies. ever. In the kitchen, we never done it together, never. So today will be, and we never done it with you guys. We never done it with the Empire. So today we're gonna bake some Christmas cookies. Oh, we won't be whipping it in the kitchen. We're gonna be baking. Huh? We're gonna be baking it. We ain't whipping it. No, we're baking. We're baking it. Oh, yeah, I'm not. We're not cooking today. We ain't cooking today. Nah. Uh -huh. Okay, you guys. So, um, I actually already opened these when my friend came over. So there's still enough left over to make what we need to make. But we're making chocolate chip cookies with sugar cookies. You guys about to see the secret recipe, okay? The hot cocoa stuff ready. Got the lined baking sheet with parchment paper. Oven is to 325. What is it, 325 on here? Yeah. All right, so put it to 350. Why? A little bit hotter. No, it's gonna burn. Oh. Uh, sure? Yeah. All right. All right, put it to 330, 330. No. Come on, just the cookies are gonna come out hard. Come on, we're cooking. It's the saucy. No, honey. we're not doing that. We're listening to the directions. The so guys, I already don't want to cook anymore. I already don't want him in the kitchen. <laughs> the cookies will come out perfect if I do it. <laughs> so, first of all, you guys, make sure y'all get the organic. Hold on. Make sure y'all get the organic cookie brand. You want to make sure you get cookies that you can eat while they're raw. That is very important. The um, Pillsbury and stuff are not organic. You cannot eat that while it's raw. And I don't know what kind of ingredients they put in there. This is all clean ingredients, you guys. You know I'm big on my organic stuff. So I just had to give that a little spiel right there, okay? So I saw this little, like, hack on TikTok or whatever. Wait, I'm gonna do it. Huh? What do you mean? We're gonna both together. do it, yeah. So what we do is take two at a time and, okay. <laughs> so we're gonna take two at a time and basically squeeze, smush them together. They'll start getting softer. Try not to lose the cookie. They'll start getting softer and easier to maneuver. They just needed to thaw out a little bit longer. Um, this is all the chocolate. Hmm? No, you'll see, you'll see. And just like smush it up into a bowl. Um, I think, babe, we need to let it sit out a little longer. Mine's doing just fine. Is it? It's yeah. not supposed to pull apart like that. Oh, that's, that's, not all, that's all yours. No, that's not for me. This just came up. This is all mine. It's pretty soft. Smush it in a bowl. How, how much of a bowl? Huh? So you're gonna make it a bowl and then just make it a little bit flat but not too flat. We're making cookies! Making cookies! Okay. And now we just do that with the rest of them. Oh! And oh that's it! Five second rule. Got story time for you guys. Oh man. So remember what we was telling y'all? Um <laughs> Yo about that birthday and when we were doing the picture show me a picture of video. If you didn't see that video, go, go watch, watch it now because so you'll know what we're talking this. about. 
So you guys asked to see a picture of us drunk, and we showed you guys a picture of us in Virginia Beach. <laughs> drunk? Drunk. <laughs> and the story leading up to that. Oh my god. The story leading up to that moment. So it was my, what birthday was it? 20. 20th birthday? 20th birthday? I think it was my 20th birthday. We went to Virginia Beach. It was like five of us. And oh my God. we it, it was like a five hour drive. It wasn't that bad. Guys, it was six, it was seven hour drive. No, it was a five hour drive. Yeah, it, was, it was more than that. No, I remember. I'm about to, where's my phone? It was a six and a half drive. It was, it was, it was something like Virginia that. Beach is a five hour drive from here. Five? I swear it's a five hour drive. Virginia Beach is five and a half hours from home. Okay. Who must have been stopping? No, I really think we just drove straight there. Yeah. I don't know why I'm and I thought far. I thought we left late and everything, but we didn't end up leaving late because when we got to Virginia Beach, <laughs> go to this hotel, nice beachfront hotel, right on the boardwalk. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. We get there, go to the check-in thing. <laughs> give them our name they're like man we're not finding your reservation i start going off like what do you mean not finding my reservation like i i booked this online i paid already like it, it was already prepaid i paid online what do you mean it's my birthday, it's it's my birthday. like yeah like we drove all the way here what do you mean mm -hmm. then they're like oh you're in for tomorrow <laughs> so i start going okay well i'm here now so can you get me in now? Like I, we need to be here now. There's, we start looking around. Nothing else is available. Everything that was available is like a one-star motel. Yeah. And if you know, honey, I'm not like I'm just I'm not like I'm not. Everything I'm not staying in nothing moment. crazy. I don't even like sleeping outside of my house. I don't even in the five-star hotel. We bring our own sheets and stuff like that. And the way I sleep in a hotel is I literally lay a sheet over and come with our own blanket to cover. So that's that's how I am. So they didn't have anything available for us. Yeah, but why didn't they? <laughs> Listen, I didn't realize that I booked for the next day. I know for a fact online I clicked that day. My so my birthday's June thirtieth. And I usually like to go on vacation two days before, two, three days before well, my actual did. birthday comes. Did you book it at a midnight thinking it was the next day maybe? Maybe. I feel like you. I, I feel like you was booking this at night time. Maybe. Yeah. yeah I think you booked it like at midnight. Night. And yo, I did time. the same thing to us for our Guatemala trip. Oh my god. And it god. just we. I I ended up booking another room for us to stay in before we got to the B and B, yeah, was, but it worked good. out because worked he out. made us miss the plane. It was good. Yeah, it, it made, worked out. Well, how I make us miss the plane? It was your fault that day. It's in the video. We can go back and Which watch one? it. When we went to Guatemala for my birthday, home? no going. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. 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 It was crazy though, cause that night we really had to stay outside. For yeah, so they hours. let's backtrack. They didn't have a room for us, so no, there that was nowhere was else booked. to stay. They were booked, and they said the earliest they could get us in was check in was at three, no nine a.m. Nine a.m. Check ins oh, at three, but God. somebody's checking out, and they can get them out. Oh no, it was eleven. Yeah, it was eleven Because someone's checking out at nine a.m., but they need at least a few hours, hours to, to clean, clean it. Yeah. Oh my God. So I think we got there for like three. I think we got there for check in time. It wasn't it, late. It, 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 it wasn't late at all. It, it was, was night still though. no. It wasn't when we first first got there. It was daytime because we took pictures on the beach. We Which went to the beach. It, oh when my we God. got there, it was um, like three p.m. Yeah, it was. It was like three p.m. So yeah, it, it hit us that now we have nowhere to stay for tonight. We're in Virginia. We're, We're in Virginia uh, Beach. We don't Muffin. know no nobody, nowhere to go. Nothing. Hey, yo, bro, let me put to your All house. the other hotels on the boardwalk are booked. So we, you know, it, it, we come to this realization that we're gonna be up all, all night. night. Like, <laughs> we brought bottles and all that, so we're like, we're just gonna get lit and see what Virginia Beach has to offer. Oh, literally. And that night, first of all, in the first two hours, we walked the boardwalk. The whole thing. The whole boardwalk. Probably walked it back and forth. Back and forth. Like three times. Mm, the whole night we were the walking back and forth, just but getting it came, lit. It came to a part where I think 
No, oh. we was we we, was, we started sneaking inside trying to. Uh, no, we didn't sneak in. What happened was they let us go in the hotel and said we could use the pool and stuff like that. If we needed first, something though, to at do. At first, we were sneaking in. Were but we? then we walked all the way to the back room trying to see if we could stay inside the hotel and shit like that. Maybe was that what it was? Yeah, and then and then they gave us a the thing. They said we could we could hang around the pool. Yeah, maybe that's what happened. Maybe that's what happened. So we go in the pool. By this time, we're lit. Like, yeah, I have videos yeah. on my phone of us, like, me and my friends just twerking every damn place. Like, every stop there was, we're just twerking. We have pictures on big chairs lit. Like, I think we started going, like, mini shopping just to get, like, grab stuff. Yeah. I got a taser, all that. Um, what else? Yeah, but we was going to hell stores. We were. And, and we were open, literally, 2, 3 a.m. Stores was yeah. open, yeah. Not a lot of places to eat, surprisingly. Um, I feel like there wasn't even a lot to do out there, and not everybody... I had a fake ID at that time, but not everybody was 21 and had a fake ID, so we couldn't go out, out. Um, so we ended up going swimming in the pool because the hotel let us go in there. It was lit. We were lit in that pool. Ooh. Lit. I remember we came out of the pool. We're sitting on like the rocking chairs outside of the hotel. Then went back in the back pool. pool. Saucy <laughs> want to tell this part so bad, so I'm gonna let him tell it. <laughs> it was this lit in the pool, y'all. Like crazy lit. Like people didn't want to come inside. Like they didn't want to come to the pool because we was in the pool. We were so lit. Like, There's videos of hit. First of all, there's a video of him directing me in the jacuzzi. No music is playing. This is how lit we are. And I'm twerking. And in the background of the video, he's like, just move up a little bit. Move to the side. Do this, do that. And I'm like, yo, this is the best video. It's so explicit. I cannot put it on YouTube for you guys. Go follow me on Instagram. I'll put it on my story. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that shit is crazy. And honey lit ass fell asleep in the pool. I don't know how you sleep in water, but you fell asleep in that pool. Inside the pool? Yes, inside. I thought I fell asleep on the chair. No, you fell asleep in the pool. Then you went on the chair. <laughs> then you fell asleep and put the towel over your face until the wind at the bottom. <laughs> By that time, it was probably like 6, 7 a.m. Oh my you god. You know what I mean? We all just. We all pretty much slept in the pool. We did, yeah. Literally you know on chairs yeah. and all that. All of us slept in the pool yeah. area. It was a bad situation in the beginning, but we made the best time out of it. Yeah. We really did. You know, stuff happens in life, yeah. and you just gotta make the best out of an effed up situation. I made that mistake multiple times now in my life, and next time I book a vacation, I'm gonna make sure that doesn't happen. <laughs> 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 Cause that really did happen for Guan. Now that I'm thinking nah, about it. Did. <laughs> Next step on the cookies. What we're doing now is just kneading the sugar cookies and placing them on top of the um chocolate chip cookies, so they'll bake inside of each other. Yeah, we're really in the kitchen making cookies right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is really our first time. Word. Mm. We've really never done nothing like this. We've been together five years. Word. Yeah, that's crazy. So it says to bake them for 14 to 16 minutes for a crisper cookie and 11 to 13 minutes for a soft cookie. So we could do 14 and a half minutes. 15? Okay. Saucy and honey. Cookie baking story, story time. time. <laughs> On the next segment, we are going to be making the hot chocolate. Um, so usually I would use the front burner, but the way the camera is, y'all are not gonna see saucy. So, so I'm gonna use this back burner. It's gonna be a little awkward for me, but don't worry. Y'all wanna see me? But now you're not gonna see me. Oh. Uh, Before we start, I may just give you the little ingredients to our um, hot chocolate. 
So to make the actual hot chocolate, I'm going to boil some ripple milk so we get some protein up in there. And then I'm going to mix in this Trader Joe's sipping chocolate. It's inspired by European tradition, guys. It's just from Trader Joe's, so like it's great, you know. <laughs> Saucy wouldn't let me get the dark chocolate, hot chocolate, so. Yeah, we're, we're gonna stick to the regular stick chocolate. To milk dark, chocolate. Dark chocolate is no bueno. No, whatever. Tastes, tastes too dark. No, it tastes amazing. <laughs> Go ahead, baby. Lead what? us off. Take us away. Take us to the moon. Guys, this is crazy, guys. So, how can I start this? So, from 2016 to like 2000, what? 19, 20? For what? My birthday. No. It happened every year. It happened, but from, it happened before you, the year before you met me. So from 15, every birthday from 2014 to 2017, for some reason, your boy Saucy ended up behind bars. <laughs> and it was never for no, like, for me, nothing crazy. For me, it was just for dumb reasons. Like, one of the reasons was me and Honey came from... Where were we coming from? First of all, what did we do that year for your birthday? For that year, we went out to eat? Went to a party or something. Did we? Didn't we? Because why were we that lit? Went to <laughs> Saucy used to be in a crew and they used to throw parties. Yeah, for those who don't know, come in, yeah, that's what we used to Surf crew for me. If y'all watch this video, man, what's up, surf crew? <laughs> <laughs> but we used to throw some crazy parties, you feel me? And that night, yeah, we got lit. lit like, and at this time, me and Saucy were renting a room. Yeah. So the warehouse party was in the area Saucy grew up in, and we the room we rented was about like. 10, 10 minutes? 15 minutes away. Yeah. yeah. We like walking distance. Literally. Literally. We could walk. Right. It'd be a, like a 20 minute walk. But you could walk all the way down the street and you'd be there. So. Oh, we was too lit though. The other thing about it, we was beyond lit. But party's over. You feel me? It's time to go home. <laughs> we pull up home. We make it home. And we sitting outside, you feel me, just lit, went to checkers, grab some food. So we outside the crib now, you feel me, and I was about to go in our one bedroom. And we just sitting down in the car, lit. And we're like, yo, babe, I don't feel like going upstairs yet. Because at the time, the room we were renting, okay, listen, just quick backstory on the room oh, we yeah. were renting. It was on the third floor, and like, it just wasn't the best conditions. Like the one day I was showering, and underneath the shit, from underneath the shower mat, a roach crawled out. I always wore shoes and stuff in the shower, so I just freaked out, okay? It just, they just weren't the best living conditions, but his family member was doing us a huge favor, so very thankful for that. But, you know, it was on the third floor. We just didn't feel like walking all the way up. We were lit, and we had food, and we were hungry. We wanted to eat, so we're like, we're about to eat in the car. And that led to us falling asleep. <laughs> yeah. Fall asleep, and this is what we wake up to. <laughs> whatever, whatever, police. And we're like, you know, jumped up all crazy. Like, we're like, Why like we what's going on? Our window's knocking. Like, what's going on? So, you know, cracked the windows down. And the cops were like, what are you guys doing? And we're like, we're just... Taking a nap, we just came from a party and we're taking a nap, we're about to go upstairs and they're like, so why is the car idling? So we're like, I was just literally just taking a nap off, so like I'm about to go upstairs, like we live right across right, literally, literally we park, right across the street. Right across the street, like get out the car and just walk that way and you're right to the house, bro. Cop, did he tell me to step out the car? Yeah. Yeah, I feel like he said he's told kept me, saying he kept step out, out the, the car. car, out the car and I kept asking him why. And then this woman came up to me on the side of the car after they got like that he finally got out of the car because like me and him are both a little bit hot headed when it comes to dealing with the cops. But me and him are each other's like calmer downers. So I'm telling him, babe, just get out, just get out. So he gets out 
and he starts talking to the male cop and this woman cop comes to my side of the car knocks on the window and goes ma'am are you on drugs and are you pregnant because at the time i was a like, little bit what? heavier i had just eaten so i'm probably looking bloated yeah we fell asleep but i'm not on no drugs and i'm not pregnant don't play me like that don't play me like that sis so then I got an attitude with her. So Saucy come back near the car telling me to calm down. And he has a warrant, lo and behold, for yeah. a damn unpaid court fine or something like that. From a damn speeding ticket oh, yeah, or something like, like that. I don't even know from it. Like, like two, two years ago. ago. And they lock him up. On my his birthday. birthday. We're telling them like it's his birthday. Um, I Thank was you. lit. I said I was lit because he was in the driver's seat. So we don't, you know, don't yeah, want no DUI, trying, nothing like that. So we're saying like I was lit. We fell asleep in the car because we ate. Here's our food. Like we live right here. Here's the keys. Like literally, like, literally the telling keys, them like, all that. I'm trying so, to make it to my room. Like all that. They so, tried to rock it. I was like. Are you guys drunk? Like, nah, I'm not talking about No, automatically came, are we on drugs? What are like, we what doing? Like, like, what? Yeah. <sighs> so, I had to go bail him out that night. Ugh. Crazy they cut night. cut my laces up, like, on Crazy my birthday. My, my fresh kicks, they took my laces and cut them. <laughs> Crazy <sighs> night. Oh, you know what was lit though? When I was in the cell for a little bit, I did have my phone for a little bit to figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think I tried to text you and then they just came and grabbed me from me, yeah. <laughs> you guys, you know, just comment down below let me know what year you want to hear a story about me being getting arrested and I'll let you know. And that is the sound. I was only around for that one, I think. No, I was around no, for one for two, more. two of them, yeah. Two of them, yeah. yeah. Okay. Damn. Answer some of y'all questions that like, I know some of y'all be asking. I have Saucy ever been arrested? Da, 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 da. Answer your questions. Yeah, I have been arrested before. You know, it's okay. There's story time for that too. <laughs> we don't need to ask nothing about no honey. If y'all want to hear about me and my personal life, go subscribe to my channel and comment what you want what to you hear. What you want to hear. Okay? <laughs> That's what I made my channel for. <laughs> Be a little more vulnerable on the for you guys. <laughs> I, another, I got another story in mind I want to share with them. Uh-oh. Which one is this one? Hoboken. I'm out. <laughs> ah! Hoboken was a crazy night. Wow. So this where, is where, literally. Where are we starting with that one? Like where? From the beginning. From, from home. <laughs> yeah, from the beginning. So <sighs> my friend got engaged <sighs> at the time. This was like right before we were about to move to Pennsylvania literally. too. So this is like one of our last outings. And again, at the time, yeah. I was. Last outing, right before we moved to Pennsylvania. So imagine all the stuff we got planned to come up here, all the stuff we got to do in the next couple of days. Keep that in mind. Right? <laughs> right? Keep that, in mind. Keep that in mind. So my friend got engaged. Really close friend at the time. Really good friend. I was so excited for her. Want to go to Hoboken to celebrate. At the time, I was 20. Had a fake ID, like always. Oh, I always had a fake ID. My friends knew this and stuff like that, but Hoboken in New Jersey is a really, like, strict area, and if they just sense that your ID is off a little bit, they're just yeah. not... They're, they're, they're just not, not gonna be... It. Yeah, they're not gonna be off it. It's because it's New York City, you feel me? Like, everybody go out there, like... But in New York City, you can get away with it because it's bigger. Hoboken just has a few great bars. True. So, their bouncers and stuff be on it. And New York can go and like, pay somebody it, off. That, I think that's where it started with the scanning IDs. Yeah, literally. <laughs> I had never literally. seen that before. But, um, so, we, my friend's engaged, we go meet up at her house, all of us, get in this big suburban Uber, we're all pre-gaming at her house or whatever, get in this big suburban Uber, it's like 10 of us. Yeah, buddy. So, we get to Hoboken, the first club we get to... Before we get to Hoboken, we in the car, we all making plans to oh, yeah. together. Yeah, together. Me? We said... If we get to this certain club and they don't let all of us in, we're going to make sure, make sure all of us go, go to the, the next, next club. One. If yep. this club will let us in, we're going to rock out to the other club. If that club will let us, we're going to get drunk and stay out the streets and do this and do that. You feel me? Mm -hmm. So They go in and they're like, can you guys go find a place that will let you in and then call us and... Oh my god. What? I had the wrong thing on this whole time. 
That's why my stuff story, wasn't story boiling. Time, story time lit. <laughs> <laughs> I had the wrong burner on. That's why my stuff not there? boiling. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so anyways, the cookies are done. <laughs> ah! I want, it was gonna be, oh, they still gotta be cooked a little bit more. Damn, I didn't flatten this enough. So first, okay, so where was I, where was I? Now that I messed this up, sorry guys, I tried you guys. <laughs> so the first place didn't let us in, so they go in and um, say, go find a place, I'll let you in, call us, and we'll come meet up with you. So we say, okay, fine, whatever, like, we're just saying, why can't we all go, but yeah. I don't like splitting up from the group and stuff like that. That's just always bad. When you're out with a group and y'all split, split up, y'all that, that know y'all not yeah, seeing each that other. That night is done. Yeah, like, the night know, is done yeah, between y'all. Like, y'all just didn't plan and then split up, like, what was the point of going it, out together? Exactly. You feel me? We could have just split in the beginning. Exactly, because exactly what, what I thought was going to happen, happened. Me and him found a place literally only like five Bruh, minutes later. And it wasn't far from the other place. It was not far. It was right around the corner. And we're not out to eat or nothing. We're literally we're just, just bars. Lit. Just bars. I mean, because she just got met. Just got engaged. Yeah, so we just out to get lit. Literally. Tell them we're at this new place. Me and him start getting shots or whatever. They say they're on their way. That was the first phone call. They're that like, was yeah, the first yeah, phone coming, call. Coming. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we're coming, we're coming, we're coming. So me and him start getting lit. I'm really lit at this point. I started getting really lit. Yeah, honey walked in there for me double shots. Yeah. Like not, not, not playing all that walking we just did. Yeah, she, and they left us. Lit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to get lit. So they end up not showing up. I think I went to the bathroom and came back and they still weren't there. Yeah, it was like seven o'clock, you called, they said it was coming, it never showed up. 8.30 came, 9. Nah, I don't I think we went out later than that. Nah, we was out there early. Were we? Yeah, we was out there like 8 o'clock. Oh. Yeah. Stayed out there till like 2. When the thing was all the way all over. All the way yeah. over, yeah. Cause oh, we, wow. we was sitting in the club waiting for them to come. Literally, the and whole night, waiting, waiting, waiting. So me and him ended up getting really lit. Eventually they stopped answering my phone calls. Literally. And I just got so lit and so friendly with that bartender that night. I ended up tipping her $150. I didn't realize until the next morning. Yeah, I'm like, where, where, where's all our money at? She's like, oh, I think I tipped her $150. What? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. That bartender was happy as hell, probably. We were so, oh. so. And we got stranded. First of all, because, yeah, we got stranded because since we weren't with them anymore, how were we going to Uber back, back to their house and get in their oh, house God. to get our keys to get in our car? Because we got there splitting the ride and the whole thing was to go back and split, and split the ride. split the ride. Our car is parked at their house. We don't know if they're home, whatever, because they're not answering. So we're calling everybody we know and Saucy's friend, Serge, thank you, Serge, came through all the way to Hoboken after work. After work, 2 o'clock in the morning. At 2 o'clock in the morning to you come pick me? us up and I was so lit. Anytime I'm really, really lit and I get in the car, it's over. The car motion, I just get the motion sickness and I body. <laughs> so I literally, like we made it two blocks down the street. I was like, Serge, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta throw up, I gotta throw up. He wasn't pulling over, so I had to roll the yeah. window down and start throwing up. And I, you know, I got it on his car and he did clean it. Thank yeah, you, Serge. He did clean it. Serge no, is a trooper. trooper wow, well, thank you, Serge. You're I really, love you for that. He's a real MVP. He's yes, always he been is. a real MVP. Yes, he yeah, has. He always he a superhero, no voice. Because <laughs> nobody was coming that night. Nobody was nobody coming to was get picking us. Up. Everybody was at work. Nobody doing was doing something. So. Even Serge almost didn't come. He, but he was like, "I got y'all. I'm on my way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I just got off work." Yep. <laughs> Yo. So yeah, because I remember him saying like, "If y'all can't find any, any other, other ride, yeah, I'll I come." Got, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And we didn't find any other ride, so he came. He sure came, yo. Yo, we really stuck. We really <laughs> stuck out there, you guys. Wow. Yo. Yo. That's crazy. Um, we always have, uh, we always, something crazy always, always happens. happens. Always. always. Like, when we make, when we make plans, it never go the way, way it's supposed plan. to go, like, some, ever. Always, like, some BS always Always. Happens. Something always pop up. <laughs> you can never win. <laughs> Check on them, 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 mignon, mignon cookies. Guys, the secret recipe to my, um, hot chocolate is a little bit of vanilla extract. Okay, from DR. 
I don't know where you guys can go pick this up, but this is Dominican Domin uh, Dominican vanilla extract. I get it from like the corner store, the bodega. So if you have a bodega near you, if you have like a Latino supermarket, you could probably find it. But I always just dump a little bit of vanilla extract into my hot cocoa and I will put a little bit of refined coconut sugar. And then Saucy's gonna taste it for us and tell me if I need more chocolate or what. You need more vanilla. Where's my refined sugar? Was that brown sugar and white sugar? No, this is refined coconut sugar. I like brown sugar. It's coconut sugar though, smell it. Oh, that's crazy. Wow. Cookies is done, you guys. Oh, shit. Damn, my square? Look at that. Oh, no, this is square. Yeah. That was a square? Yeah. No, that was a square. Was it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. It looks like it would still be still. the square. <laughs> yeah, I want to cool them like this, though. Yeah, so flip them onto this. Oh, but it might seep through. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But they have to cool on this. Uh, well, I'll just put it just like that one. It's gonna get hard though. Look how it's crispy already on the outside. vanilla in there Ugh. more sugar <laughs> do you want me to make you swiss miss bae yeah. <laughs> all right you guys so the hot chocolate is finished you gotta see how hot chocolate is right <laughs> saucy made his own swiss miss <laughs> i have real hot chocolate me i don't too. know about saucy me too i have real hot cocoa i got i got real hot chocolate too baby so now we about to dress them up and y'all gonna judge whose is better. Alright you guys, we did it! We malfunctioned, but we did it. Let me taste my hot cocoa. Hopefully it's not too hot. I want this a cookie. Let's see what the cookie's going for. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Mmm. We finessed. Mm-hmm. Wow. Mmm. Nice and soft. Wow. Oh. Well, you guys. First of all, whose hot chocolate is better? Mine or Saucy's? Mine. Mine. Comment down below. Comment down below. Mine was better. Saucy's was not. This is the end of the video. Whoa, 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 whoa. If you enjoyed this video, Would make sure to like, like, comment, and subscribe. and subscribe to the Empire. Turn them bells on because without further ado, it's post notification shout, shout out time. Shout out goes to MV Williams notification 
gang all the way from Alabama. Shout out to you. The rest of y'all turn them bells on. Comment down below when it is done. If you enjoyed this video, you guys, comment down below if you want to see more story times from us. You know, more, more cooking, cooking videos. videos. We can make it work in our kitchen. I, I think we can make it work. We can make it work. But I enjoyed the story time. If you guys did, comment down below. And comment down below what your favorite story was. was. Facts. <laughs> Alright, we will see you in the next vlog, Miss